boys, hi girls, hi moms, hi dads. It's Cheryl at the Children's Clinic. And listen, this month, the month of May, happens to be National Mental Health Awareness Month. So let's read about and talk about paying attention to and taking care of our mental health because how we feel can affect how we think and how we act. So we have to really take care of that. Today we're going to read a book. I really enjoyed it. I had so much fun reading this book. It's called Dear Me. It's Dear Me by Donna Tetrault. And it's about this child who writes notes and letters to himself. Dear Me. Letters to myself for all my emotions. Okay, let's get started. I think you're going to enjoy it too. I'm a happy little boy most of the time. And he certainly looks cheerful. Mom says the many ways that I feel are called emotions and that it's okay to feel every single one of them. She tells me it's okay for everyone in our family to feel their emotions. All these different things that we can feel so many more. This is just some of them. And I'm sure you felt these excited, unsure, bubbly, loved. It's my favorite one. But these are emotions. And when we feel those things, it's okay. Because sometimes we might feel even sad, sometimes even mad, but that's okay too. It's what we do with it and about it. I feel good when I'm happy or excited, but I don't like being sad or scared. Mom says she understands. She wants to teach me how to think about my emotions in a new way. A pencil and paper is how we start. Mom says writing my feelings down is one way to feel my emotions. I just have to write what's in my heart and I can manage how I feel. It's up to me. And that's true. It's all up to you. So as the story begins, it's a brand new day. The sun is shining. I'm going to play at the park. Today, I am excited. That's the emotion he's feeling. So he wrote about that. Dear me, I love feeling the sun's warm glow on my face. If I could, I'd climb up and down the trees all day long. Love me. Let's see what his next letter will be about. It's the first day at a new school. I'm afraid to meet my teacher. What if I don't make any friends? Today, today I'm scared. He wrote that letter. Dear me, it's okay to be scared, mom says. My teacher will be kind and that I'll make new friends. It just takes some time and practice to feel comfortable. Love me. And then, this morning, Dad left for a work trip. He will be gone for three whole days. I will miss him so much. Today, I'm sad. Dear me, it's natural to be sad, and I know Dad has to work. I really, truly do. Mom says I'll see him Friday afternoon, and he'll take me to the bookstore. All right, love me. Oh, look at that. He says, I reach for mom's hand when we visit grandma at the hospital. It's cold here and I have to be quiet. Today, I am worried. Dear me. Feeling worried is just another one of my emotions. Mom says she's worried too. It's okay for us to feel this way. We can take deep breaths to feel better. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Dear me, I love me. During soccer practice, we have to stop 
plan to take team pictures. I want to play soccer right now. I don't want having my picture taken. Today I am mad. Dear me, taking pictures wasn't so bad. I didn't take too it didn't take too long and I got to dribble the ball while I waited. Now I will have these pictures to look at and remember my team forever. Love me. Wasn't so bad. All these things you notice that you can get over them. Mm -hmm. Write it down. Talk about it. My best friend in the whole wide world is sad because his goldfish died. He cries. I hug him. He has emotions too. Today I am kind to others. Dear me, I know I have the power to help anyone who is sad, even myself. I am a kind person. I am a loving person. Love me. Playground, I want to swing high on the swings at the playground. I want to feel like a bird flying. Oh, I fell off. Oh, will kids laugh at me? Will anyone help me? Today, I feel embarrassed and surprised. Dear me, one kid laughs, but it's okay. Another helps me up. She smiles big and says, you like being high in the sky, don't you? I like when kids choose to be kind. Love me. It's Taco Salad Tuesday again. I don't like taco salad. I like regular old tacos. Can't we just have Taco Tuesday minus the salad? Today I'm frustrated. Dear me, mom says she understands I am frustrated, but she explains she wants me to enjoy healthy meals too. She makes a deal. Tacos only next Tuesday. How about that? Love me. I love bath time. My brother and I laugh, we splish, we splash, we make lots of bubbles. Today I am joyful. That looks like fun. Dear me, I wish we could stay in the bath way past bedtime. This is our special time. Today we made our first bubble inside a bubble. So cool. Love me. It's raining outside. I like watching the rain. Mom says it's a good time to relax and get cozy. I will count the raindrops that fall on my window. Today I am peaceful. Dear me, I lose count of all the raindrops, so now I just listen. Drip, drop, drip, drop, drip, drop. I start to collect my dear me letters. Love me. Now is the perfect time to show mom all of my letters. I tell her that I understand that all of my emotions are what make me, me. Mom agrees. She says she is very proud and gives me a big hug. I am proud of myself too. I know I can manage my emotions anytime I want. All I have to do is start with, dear me. And you can do that too. No matter what I feel, after thinking about it and talking about it, I can always choose to be happy again. Every day is a good day. I choose to be happy. How about you? See you next time.